I'm Matt Minyard and I'm in front of this beautiful MacFly with the Pelini Thor engine and I'm inside of the Pelini Thor engine factory. I'm in the engine candy shop now, baby. All of the components that they make for this engine come from this factory under this roof. So my mind is blown that I'm actually here making this video for you. So hit that like button if you didn't do it yet. Share the love, please. I'm super excited, a little bit jacked up on Italian coffee, to be honest. I'm thrilled to do an engine review for you. So stay tuned and watch this whole video. Be sure to subscribe, comment down below if you've flown a Thor engine or if you're gonna be flying a Thor engine for your next engine. I'm an expert paramotor pilot, flying over 10 years, flying in over 30 different countries, trying to be the best pilot that I can be. And for years, I've been looking up to my champion Alex Mateos who's the owner the brain behind MacFly Paramotors. This is a full titanium MacFly. You've probably seen my other videos. I've got a lot of them flying a MacFly. These frames can harness the power the best. Paramotors have a turning spinning propeller on the back. So just like that, the paramotor frame wants to torque and twist, and it wants to cause you to fly in an uncomfortable fashion. Thanks to the continued work and development from Alex, this paramotor to me is the best, for me. Over 100 kilos of thrust, that's crazy. <laughs> I've been flying it for years and years, and I've been flying this engine for over a year now to really understand its key points. So this is a liquid-cooled engine. It's for expert paramotor pilots. It's also for beginner pilots. It's also for intermediate pilots. It's temperature stable. So if you want to fly full throttle like I fly all the time, it doesn't overheat. They've been testing these things for years. We have a nice carbon E-prop on the back, the world's best, lightest propeller, smooth transition of thrust when you apply the throttle. We can see the airbox is modern and it goes into the carburetor that they make in this factory. I want to compliment, these titanium welds are just impeccable. I mean, they're perfect, every one of them. I don't know who welds this, but I want to meet him and take this guy out for dinner because these welds are flawless. Maybe he can teach me how to be perfect on the welding, but I have a long way to go. These are the titanium rods, which are available. These are the carbon fiber rods, which are for anti-torque. You can twist these to cancel out the torque, depending if you have a 200 or a 300, you can adjust torque compensation to your needs. It turns out after a year of testing, the engine doesn't even produce as much torque. They have a counter rotating shaft and other technologies. So these are actually way too effective. We tend to flatten them in the competition to continue flying straight. These pair of motors are, for me, the most comfortable, for me, the absolute best, for me, the most pleasurable to fly cross country, for economy, for acro, for travel. This one rod from here to here by itself comes apart. This one comes apart, this one comes apart. It packs flat into a travel case. And for that reason, I can go to many countries with my paramotor. So I trust it and I feel comfortable to fly it for long periods of time over unlandable terrain and whatever that I choose to do. Notice that the net is very, very minimal drag so that the airflow to the propeller is as much as possible. That gives you more thrust. That gives you better economy, better glide, less noise. Notice that our fuel tank is raised up. You have a lot of fresh air to contact the tips of the prop, which is where all your thrust is actually coming from. It's not all coming from the center. It's all coming from the tip. When we see all this airflow and this minimal frame design with the airfoil shape of the tube of the cage, that's what makes it first class. And that's why I choose MacFly. And that's what really got me on board with the whole movement a couple of years ago. As you can see, this is first class. This is for me. This is what experts fly. World champions win with this equipment. And they've been winning for years. In fact, Alex and Marie Mateos both just beat me in every single comp I've ever been to and I'm proud to say that now I know why they can fly with such confidence and authority. The swing arms are very comfortable. They're also bent a little bit offset so that when you're applying full throttle, you have a static torque compensation as well as a dynamic torque compensation. These are complementary items. There's a lot of paramotors that try their best to compensate torque and they just do not hit the same goal that we've already hit with MacFly. So take it for what it's worth. I'm an expert in my field. I've been doing it 
to 10 years. I've flown in over 30 countries. I've flown with all the best pilots in the world. We're on a first name basis. Every day we're on the phone trying to be better and try to improve our game. So if you like this video, smash the like button, comment down below what you fly and what you want next. And it's been a pleasure to show you this motor inside of the Polini factory. I'm super thrilled to be here and stay tuned for more adventure videos of us flying the Italian countryside with the beautiful Mac flies. Peace out everybody. See you in the next one.